Okay, everybody. So I have, it's Friday, and I have a lease house tour for you. I am actually standing on the front porch of it because it's raining. It has been raining solid heavy all day. Some of our streets are flooded. So um, I'm not going to stand out in the rain and show you, but it's a little red brick. And um, we're getting ready to go in there. So hang tight. Before we get started, I just want to take a moment and give a shout out to my girl, Stacy Sly. Um, she and I were supposed to meet up, um, but my mom had a stroke. I had to go to Lubbock. Stacy has been a viewer of mine from the beginning. I've told you guys that. Um, we didn't get to see each other, but we did swap mail. So I just want to take a second and appreciate my earrings from Miss Stacy. I want to appreciate my shirt that says Mountain Mama on it. I absolutely love it. She also got me a tea towel that's cute as a button. Cute as a button. Um, so I just want to say hey Stacy I love you girl I'm glad you got your package in the mail too and um, let's get started on this tour okay so we'll just start right here on the front porch uh, let's go into the entryway tile floor I am going to turn around and lock it when I'm here by myself I like to keep the doors locked and that one's tough that's a tough lock. Okay, maybe we're not locking it. We'll have to get Mark to fix that. It'll lock, it's just tough to lock. So, okay, if we take a left, we take another left, we come into this adorable kitchen. Look at this, just tons of cabinet space. I'm backed up against the wall, sorry. Huge window. I love a window over a kitchen sink. I love a window in a bathroom. And I especially love a giant window over the sink. Um, let me back out into here and get some more light on. There we go. Let's back up a little bit so y'all can appreciate the whole thing. Cute, cute, cute. Cabinet space is just keeps going on forever. So then we are going to go through this door which is off of the kitchen and that goes into your laundry room and it comes with a washer and dryer if you go through this door which I'm not going to open it goes out to a two-car garage if you open this door it goes out to a pretty cool backyard with a deck the last resident put that pergola there with the uh, swing and left it here it's windy, so we're just gonna leave it there. But it's got a great backyard, deck, steps, it goes over there. I'm not gonna go stand in the rain. Um, but there's a backyard down there below the hedges that goes around and all, all the way around the side of the house. So it's a pretty neat backyard. I'm gonna come back through here. Let me lock this door up. We are going to go to, there's a little bar in the kitchen. Um, this is a vinyl, a vinyl faux ceramic vinyl floor. That's real ceramic tile there. Um, this is the original hardwoods, worn and old, how I love them. Patio door, and this is the dining room area that looks into the living room area with a big mirror. I don't know if Jack bought the house like that or if, who put that there? Um, but great big living room. And if you look at it from this side, there's the dining room and it just goes on forever. Just goes on forever. Love all the windows, love all the windows. Okay, then we're gonna come back out here, back into the entryway. We're gonna take a left, and there's one bedroom, one small bedroom there. 
the hallway, bathroom with a window, gorgeous brown tile. <laughs> hey! There's another bedroom here with the last resident that painted. This is the master bedroom, and the last resident painted. It's like a, a navy blue wall. There's not good lighting in here, so you can't really tell. But we just left it. Instead of painting over it, Mark's like, I'm just leaving that wall. And I'm like, that sounds good to me. And then it's got a half bath here. Back here. And then we're going to go. There's some storage there. Hall closet space. I haven't even opened those. Yeah, awesome. Awesome, awesome. And then a third bedroom here. Here. And that looks back down the hallway. So I'm going to turn some of these lights out. And let's see if I can get these out. That's my lease house tour. We have another house um, that just got new flooring today. It's probably our biggest rental house. It's also older. All of our rental homes are older. Um, and as soon as that one's done, I can't wait to take you guys in there. Um, but this one, I just put it up on Zillow and it's on Craigslist. And I just put it up day before yesterday and I've just getting tons of calls. And so I've got an appointment at 11 o'clock Monday morning to show this. And then I've got three or four emails I need to answer back on this particular house. So this one's going to go fast. This one leases for $8.50 a month. Um, that's about it. $650 deposit. $8.50 a month. Um, I will have this leased by next week. This one's going to go fast. So let's turn these lights off. I just adore this kitchen. These doors lock. I'm gonna have to have Mark double check. I know I can get that front door locked, but I have to fight it every time. So I'm gonna have to have him come and fix that. So, okay, well, happy Friday, everybody. And we need to fix that up. It's one of those old kind of light on so I can see because because I'm old. There we go. Um I don't know what I was saying. I have no idea what I was saying. Except that it's Friday. I am grateful that it's Friday. Um, as you guys know, I manage two apartment communities and about um, 48, I think we're on 48 rental houses now. So as of Monday, I am giving up one of the apartment communities because um, having two about 200 units to lease by myself um, is a lot. And so I am passing the torch on Brookwood. So that will leave me with um, 102 units to manage. So that's a little more manageable and I won't be running around like a chicken with my head cut off and running around like psycho crazy. So I'm really grateful to pass the torch. Um, on one of my apartment communities. So I will still have all the rental houses and um, one apartment community. So I will office out of one space instead of two. And um, I'm usually officing out of my car and both apartment communities. Now I'll just be officing out of my car and one apartment community. So one desk, one office, and I'm looking forward to that. So anyway. Um, Shane and I um, are going to go eat breakfast in the morning. We are going to go picking, antiquing, flea markets, estate sales, all that stuff. We're going to go into Claremore. For those of you who are familiar with the Tulsa area, um, we're going to poke around Claremore. And we are going to go eat breakfast at the casino. We're going to eat breakfast at the casino, go poke around Claremore, and then we're going to come back. Um, through South Tulsa and stop at Buffalo Wild Wings and watch the OU Army game. So we're going to go, go, go all day tomorrow and I will, I plan on vlogging it. I don't know why I wouldn't be able to. So I plan on vlogging that so everybody can say hi to Shano 
and um, it'll be an Amy and Hoppy day. Um, he got to have the whole day off because of the weather. Like, when we woke up this morning, I was like, enjoy your day off. <laughs> so, um, anyway. Okay, that's it. I'm just running my mouth. Um, I'm going to go home. We don't have any kids tonight, so we might play some vinyl records, have a little glass of wine, make some dinner. Maybe we'll go to dinner. I don't know what our plans are, but... Um, I'm trying to get out of here and get this weekend started. I love you. The Lord loves you more. And we will see you in the next video. Bye.